make me look hotter. <gasps> yeah. No, Seth. Sorry, what? Yeah. Oh, my God. What about God. this thing? Uh, I think we can split it at the seams. What? Split it. Okay. Are yeah. you serious? No. Oh, oh my God. God. That's Bye. nice. Yeah. Pilates are. Guys. I love that. Ooh. All right, you recognize her from Hacks and Shameless. She is now starring in the new season of The L Word, Generation Q. Now, Generation Q continues to follow The L Word's cast of characters as they struggle with secrets as well as old scars and new flames on their search for the one. And playing Roxy, the girl whose life is an endless party, is Paula Andrea Placido. Thank you so much for being here with us live. We, First of all, you're fierce. Mm -hmm. That's one. Yes. Two, you know, you're joining this show in its third season. What is your character up to? Uh, well, first of all, thank you for having me. Um, my character is Roxy. Uh, she is, like you said, uh, life of the party. She is spontaneous fun. She comes in at the right time. She is a childhood best friends with Danny, one of the leads. And she comes in at the right time to kind of help her friend loosen up a little bit, have some fun, maybe uh, forget a little bit about the situation she's in in the current moment. Mm, I like it. Hey, there are some big names attached to this series. We've got Jennifer Beals, Margaret Cho, uh, Joanna Cassidy, even Rosie O'Donnell. Mm. What is it like to work with some of these established stars? Is it a challenge or do you enjoy it? Tell us a, a little bit more about it. Oh my God, I, I didn't get to meet Rosie O'Donnell, but I would have died had that happened. <laughs> <laughs> right, right, absolutely. Yeah, oh my God, icon. Um, I did get to meet Jennifer Beals. I, that, I wanna, it's like seeing like a Greek goddess. Mm. She has this, she has this presence uh, I was terrified. I didn't. I, I kind of just like just just shut up. Don't say anything. Don't, don't look. And she was so sweet, so nice. Mm -hmm. She introduced herself, and uh, being on that set with that cast and crew, they they really made me feel like I was at home. Oh, so that is good. I was intimidated at first, but that that chilled out real quickly. Uh, you were just a human being because <laughs> I probably would have been the same way. I bet you she smells good too, doesn't she? Oh, I, bet. I could just. I could oh my just, god. See it and feel it, okay? <laughs> See it and feel it. So, you, oh, too. I didn't expect you to be so tall. I was like, oh man, <laughs> <laughs> I love it. You know, you're also set to star in the new Apple Plus series, Sugar, alongside Colin Farrell. Talk about heavy hitters again. Tell us a little bit about that. Oh man, I I grew up watching him. So, uh, Phone Booth was one of my favorite movies as a kid. I used to have the DVD and watch it all the time. So. It, it felt so surreal to like be on set with him. And then he's just the kindest, nicest, down to earth human being. I was not expecting him to be so cool. Wow. Uh, that, was, that was really exciting. And then also I got to work with like, uh, one of my favorite directors, Fernando, he did uh, City of God, Ooh. which is this Brazilian movie. And once I saw those names, I was like, I have to get on this show. Whatever it is, I have to do it. <laughs> Whatever it takes. I love that. It. Hey, you've established yourself as a visual artist. Tell us a little bit more about what that all involves. Well, visual arts for me is like a family tradition. My mom's a painter. My uncle's a painter. My cousins. I come from a long line of painters. So I remember I was like a little kid and I was drawing stick figures and my mom was like, hold up, hold up. Let me let me show you something. And she drew like a human, a woman and a man. And that kind of started the journey for me. So I just started like drawing and eventually I, I went to art school and I was able to develop painting. So now I am I love painting hands. That's uh, one of my favorite things to do. And that comes from like the creation of Adam, Michelangelo. I, I fell in love with that. Um, and now I'm exploring a little bit more abstract with colors and, and, and figures. So wait a minute. Not but, only are you cool, but you also have talent. Did you paint what's mm -hmm. behind you right there? I've been looking at it this yeah. entire interview. Yeah, that's, a, that's a quarantine painting for me. Oh, wow. my gosh. That is it's so beautiful. Cool. I love, girl. That is gorgeous. Say what? Thank you. Uh, well, first of all, next time you come, you know, you could just... 
give us a lesson. Because <laughs> yeah, because I'm other still doing figures. You know what I'm saying? Yes. Not my ministry. Obviously mm. yours. You're amazing. The new episodes of The L Word Generation Q Season 3 premiere on Showtime, on streaming, and on demand on Fridays. Paula, you're so cool. Please come back and join us yes. sometime. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you.